Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be doing my weekly plan with me video. I am going to be planning for, geez, we're already almost halfway through, August 10th through August 16th. I feel like we just started August, so it's pretty crazy. We're going to be, when I'm filming this, when you're seeing this, I'm sorry, not when I'm filming, when you're seeing this, we're going to be nine days in and then start of the 10th. Crazy, crazy, crazy. So this past week has been eventful for sure. I did have a lot going on with work and with, of course, trying to get my studying time in and I still managed to get it in luckily. Yesterday I didn't do much. Today I also didn't do as much as I wanted to, but I did have to do some work. So I've done as much as I could and I did my best. That's what counts. So that's basically been the story of my life lately. Nothing else. I've been filming a lot more of my videos during the weekend. So I just put here when I uploaded and then on this little box on Friday, I don't film everything like on the same day, obviously, like on Friday or something, but I use this box for any ideas or things that I need to film for the upcoming week. So overall it was a good week. Busy week though, but that's okay. Better than, I don't know, the opposite. Okay, so I'm gonna keep with the theme I've been going with. Lately with my stickers, I've been buying one of the full boxes and then one of the washi from Planner K and then sticking with it for like practically the whole month. So last week and the week before, which were the first two of August, I used the same kit, which is MK248A. And I've been loving this kit so, so much. I feel like it fits exactly my idea of summer, like in my head. So I'm gonna stick with it. I'm gonna end up matching again with this one actually and the blue right or should i go with the daisies or i'm sorry the sunflowers and the yellow i think i'm gonna go with the blue and then i'll use this one for the next week because i think i have two more after this week not including this week i think i have two more weeks in august so this is the one i went with super cute little heels right are they high heels yes i always mix this up i think before i thought there was something else because I know Kate has used that kind of style in the past. And these don't fit exactly on the hor the hor not horizontal, <laughs> on the hexagon in the little kaleidoscope design that's in my planner, but I don't really care that much, so it's okay. I do use an Erin Condren Life Planner. I use the vertical version of it. I already, the way Erin Condren works is she releases new planners in July, or in May, beginning in July of that year. But I use the annual planner just because in my head I feel like that's kind of how I work. So I already know what I'm going to get next year. I will be getting the Flower Power Hourly. And it will be my first time getting an hourly planner, which I'm very excited about. So I'm going to go ahead and to get this little, you can't really see it, but this part's off. I'm going to get back here, my little divider. No, I won't put it in. And then I'll just cut this off like that. So what was I talking about? Oh yeah, the planner. Oops, I just dropped my little, that's okay. So for the planner for next year, I've been watching a lot of, a lot more than usual planner videos and I'm just so, so excited to get the Flower Power Hourly. I feel like the Hourly as my preference, oops, I need to pick up my, no, I'll just cut it with my finger. As my like planner style, if that's, not too cheesy like my planner style has evolved i feel like i'm just growing more into using the functionality of the hourly in terms of what i plan for so i'm very very excited to use that so after i put the main design i use now in my really my planner is some type of washi strip and my full box so next i move on to my scripts which i have a lot of and of course i'm using planner k and of course, if you've seen any of my other videos, I'm using Sarah Marie stickers. These are the two shops that I buy from. So first, I'm going to use Work From Home. I'm an accountant. I work full time. And I'm lucky enough to be one of, one of the people able to work from home and still have full time work. So I do like to mark off at the top my little work from home sticker. And I feel like 
I need to get more work from home stickers soon. I think that's what I'm gonna do this Sunday. I'm pretty sure. Oh, yeah, this Sunday is Sarah Marie's new releases for for the next not the next month for what is it called October and whenever she releases new stickers for like the budgets and stuff because that's the biggest I guess part of my purchases from her from her shop whenever she releases them is also when I go ahead and get up get up uh, not get up get any of my other stickers that I want from her shop so I think I'm gonna not I think I know I'm gonna get some work from home stickers from her because I do like the powder cake ones but I feel like the minimal like thin not as bold ink I guess style of the stickers fits more with what I like so I'm definitely going to be getting some studying has gone well it hasn't gone bad and it hasn't gone great I'm very much hitting averages of like low 80s high 70s which is not ideal but because I'm still reviewing and I'm still just getting into the zone sometimes I'm a night like a night owl all the way I can't I can't get up at five in the morning and like exercise and like do all that all that good stuff so early so it's a bit of a brain drain at the end of the day but I it's better than nothing because I really couldn't I couldn't handle and I don't take breaks the most I do I mean the least I do even on a day when I'm not truly studying is still study for at least half an hour like at least so that's one thing I did last time was I would take like a full day off which is not it just doesn't work for my brain my brain just needs the constant retention the constant review and the audit material is not awful it's it's for me it's interesting and it's not I don't know all right sorry about that I know this happened in my, I think my second to last plan with me and my phone just dies on or gets so full in storage it cut me off but I was talking about studying I yeah I don't mind audit that much I really don't it's not I'm using the checklist from Sarah Marie by the way it's not the worst I feel like it's a lot of critical thinking a lot of theory a lot of just not as much calculating and not as I, f I feel like it's not as brain draining as far was Ugh, I'm gonna I'm just focusing on audit but I know I'm gonna spend like seriously like four freaking months studying for far just because I can't handle the pressure of learning 10 chapters in like eight weeks and reviewing it and everything and it just depends on I mean everyone works differently everyone's brains understand things differently so that's just me I use these little checklists and I know you would have seen it in other plan with me's but I use these little checklists to check off the portions of studying that I'm getting done so for example the lecture skills practices are two separate things so those are like the first two I'll, I'll look at I usually skip over skills practice though and then I'll do multiple choice questions and progress tests and if I have time during the day I try to do a couple of flashcards I'm not a big fan of the flashcards though but they're not they're, they're not that bad so on the side here I'm gonna use a what am I gonna use I'm gonna use one of these so I have a leftover little um add-on for the hourly that my sister gave me again from Planner Kate this one's an old kit though it's 241 MK241 so I'm just gonna stick with the black like theme I've got going here with these boxes and over here on my little sidebar I'm gonna do that and then I'm gonna use it to do so I don't know I spend three dollars a month on extra storage for my iCloud for Apple and I don't even know if it's worth it because I still keep losing storage I need to look better into that because I think the storage that is being relied on for videos is different than the storage I'm paying the extra three dollars a month for and it's not the end of the world, it's $3, but over a year, that's $36. Over a couple of years, that's almost 100 so it adds up for me. So what I'm doing with these boxes as well is using the script stickers I have from Sarah Marie. And I'm, there we go. I'm just going to put in 
the scrub stickers here to kind of highlight it because I like how that looks. I always do planner time and grocery time on the weekends and I also got a budget time sticker from Sarah Marie's shop. So I'm gonna put all of those bad boys in. I like to do this whole process where I do the decorative full bar and washi, then I do the scripts, and then I do my doodles. My doodle girls and my doodle doodles from Planner Kate. So I'm also not good at, if you're OCD, I'm sorry, if you're, I'm not good at putting the stickers down straight all the time. That one's really, really bad. I'll probably fix that later, but for the sake of time, I'm gonna move on because I will get really frustrated if I have to keep deleting a million things. I just deleted a lot of stuff, so I, it, it probably won't, but just in the back of your head, you know, when something's already kind of happened once, you think it's gonna happen again. So I like the black, actually. I thought it would look a little too much with the yellow, but oh my gosh, why did I think of it? <laughs> I thought of black and yellow, black and yellow, that old song. I can't sing to save my life, so I'm not gonna try to, but I was thinking, why did I think that when, of course, that super popular song was around forever? So this is a new sheet, a brand new sheet of the Weekend Script Stickers, and I love this flag. I feel like it looks so pretty and simple. I like that it's just all like one solid color and it's not too over the top. So the question is which one to use. I think I'm gonna go with this one to kind of match my full box and the little very, very thin, it's super thin washi at the bottom. Okay. So I just like to put that up here. That's a little too low. Bring it up. No, that was a really strong stick. Sometimes the stickers won't always stick perfectly and that's totally fine, but that's not straight either, but it's okay. Cute, cute, cute. Okay, so I got my work from home, my study, my planner time, grocery time, and budget time. I do also use um, sometimes a binge watch, but Next week, I don't think I'm going to have much time for binge watching. What I do want to do is put down when I'm uploading. So I'm just going to grab that really quick. So this is a sheet from Planner Kate as well. It's S600 and I love it. Besides the upload though, what I'm going to do here on this Friday is this little box. I'm going to use it again to put when I'm doesn't want to come off. I'm just going to like write out later what I want to film for the week. I'm just going to do film dash edit. And then this is this little yellow line is kind of like the underlining of it. So I'm also going to upload my upload schedule that I've decided on is Wednesday, is Saturday, Sunday, and Wednesday, just because I want something during the week, just so it's not only on the weekend. And I just feel like that works. It works out. Oop, that one got stuck a little. And these are all removable, so you can, if you mess something up, or if you move something around, or if you want to reuse stickers, which I've done a lot in the past, I just would pick them up. It takes a little bit of, like, being careful with it, and making sure you don't rip the sticker but it does work so so how did I do it last week so I put them down here but I don't think I want to do that I think I want to keep them up here so I think I'm just gonna I'll put here like on the side what I'm uploading basically So again, Saturday, Sunday, and Wednesday. Every Sunday is a plan with me, so really the ones that change around are the Wednesday and Saturday videos. I like this schedule because I feel like I can get a lot done on the weekends. And as I get more, I guess, either material, like footage from studying or ideas, I'll probably upload a little bit more often, but for now, three videos a week is what works for me. Perfect, so next up are my doodles because I don't think I have anything else, right? Oh no, I forgot my study. Let me get 
Did I run out of the boxes? Uh oh, I think I lost it. Well, it'll be the same as last week, so let me show you last week's. Actually, you know what I'll do? I'll just bring over last week's. And that shows you like just how removable these stickers really are. So, over here, I always put down the different modules that I'll be studying for the week. Next week, I'm starting chapter five, which is crazy to me because that means I only have one chapter left after that. So I'll just do Monday through Sunday, and then I'll put each module each day that I'm going to be reviewing. There's eight modules in chapter five, so hopefully I can do two modules in one day, and then be done with the chapter and give myself plenty of time to review before I start chapter six, which actually, no, I wouldn't. I would only have a day, but anyway, I would move on, basically. <laughs> I wouldn't spend, because with chapter four, I spent two weeks on, and I don't want to do that with chapter five because chapter six, I think, also has 11 modules, so I might spend two weeks on that one as well, just because I can't get in more than one module a day, depending on the material. We'll see how it goes. Okay, what's next? I think I'm gonna stick with this baby blue with my doodles. So each doodle page has different colors of the same, of the same design, and I absolutely love 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 these doodles from planner kate she just is killing the game every time and they all have different colors on them and i got the ones that kind of remind me of like books and studying and that sort of thing just because it's such a big part of my day and i feel like it's cute to just go around decorating different parts of the sheet and again i do write in it a lot in this middle one like i'll put my dog's medicine i'll put when i do my retinol so this middle box is kind of like the little writings and then the studies at the bottom and at the top is work or anything related to filming which is work too so it kind of goes with it i like putting this little sticky note because i just write like a cute little quote on it and it just adds like an extra design of something so i think i'll put that here no here so I'll put like, do your best or like you can do it or something like that. So it's fun. I'm really debating today. I'm probably going to, I'm going to FaceTime my sister after I film this, getting a bike, like an indoor cycling bike from Amazon for $160. I always wanted to save up eventually to get a Peloton because all of, I feel like all of the cool athletic people have those indoor cycles and a couple of my friends do have them. So I'm, I'm obviously nowhere near a financial position to get one, but the Amazon bike is, from what my sister told me, is really, really worth the money. It's like a really great bike. You're getting a, a bargain deal, basically. So, you know what? I need to find, okay, I'm going to use these. So Sarah Marie releases, like I said, her new stickers on Sunday. So I'm going to put down... To market just so I can have a little event to look forward to during the week and put it right here and then I'll write in ah oh, it doesn't fit but ceremony releases and then I need to look at what time it is I think it's at five so it would be at five but for now, I'm going to go ahead and start with my doodles. I love these, again, Planner Kate's Doodle Girls and Doodle Doodle designs are the freaking best. So I always put the nose spin near the beginning of the week because I do, and I usually succeed, luckily, I don't spend outside of bills during the week because on the weekend we'll eat out at least once. On the weekend, I might, like today, I might end up buying something, so... Where did I put the design last time? Okay. Remember it was on a Thursday. Because I thought that was cute, like the Thursday and the Monday had the doodle girls on it. And then grocery time. I'll put over here. No, because I don't want it to get in the way. I'm actually probably going to do the Walmart. No. I'll put it here. 
If I end up going at seven, I'll go at seven. No, I don't want to. Um, I'm gonna move my upload sticker so I can put the grocery time one here. And I'll put this over here. Perfect. So I'm probably gonna move that grocery time sticker to make it more straight because that's gonna really bother me. But that is it for this week. Again, that's my system. This is my color scheme for the week, like the navy blue with a bit of black. And I absolutely love it. Planner Kate, Sarah Marie stickers are both killing the game in terms of planner stickers. And you can see here just the quality from, well, first the planner is a good one. The Erin Conjure Life planner is really a great quality product, but the stickers are just super cute too. So again, this is usually the, how the end product looks. This is the current product now, and this is kind of my foundation for the week. And just for the sake of time, I won't write in every little thing that I'm doing because that would just be like a 40 minute plan with me. And while well, I got time for that, who knows if everyone else does, right? So this is kind of my setup, pretty much like 75% done. So that's it for this video. Guys, thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe to this channel to support future videos like this one. And again, my upload schedule is every Saturday, Sunday, and Wednesday at 5 p.m. Central Time. So stay tuned. I will talk to you all soon. Bye, everyone.